What's up? This is Rapids. So why do Yo Gotti hate Young Dolph so much? It looks like Black Youngster did too. And Yo Gotti's brother, Big Juke. Now, the hatred for Yo Gotti got them in a jam because it looks like this whole thing turning into a Fed case now. At first, it was just a random hit on Young Dolph like it was him being in the wrong place at the wrong time. But now it's starting to turn into a paid hit, they're trying to call it. They're picking up people and they're picking them up on Fed charges now. So this whole thing could expand. And if you notice, Black Youngster has gone quiet now all of a sudden. Because he got jammed up in the whole Young Dolph thing before a few years back. But they dropped the charges. Now it looks like they might have finished the job if they were involved. I mean, this is speculation. But from the looks of it, with this whole thing going Fed... And the evidence coming out now that the police know it was a paid hit. They're saying money was involved to take out Young Dolph on site. He had a bag on his head. So if it turns out that Yo Gotti had anything to do with that or his brother Big Jook, I mean, this thing could get pretty messy now. Yo Gotti, you know, he was doing his thing with CMG. He had signed 42 Doug. He signed Glorilla. He has... His art is popping. I think Money Bad Yo's on the label as well. So CMG, the label, doing their thing. So why is he even worried about Young Dolph? Young Dolph looked like he took his money and his situation and just was focusing on the music. Now, I ain't saying he was no saint in the streets of Memphis. Whatever Yo Gotti is mad at Young Dolph for, it could be some serious stuff. Because Young Dolph used to be in the streets. Okay, so it's not clear what he did to make them so upset with him. But apparently, Yo Gotti hated Young Dolph and the whole CMG group. I mean, how black youngster and Yo Gotti hate uh, Young Dolph? Or is Yo Gotti the one that hates Young Dolph and calling all the shots behind the scenes? And black youngster was just following orders. See, that's the thing. If, if it turns out they got any evidence... That will lead to Yo Gotti being the mastermind be behind all the hatred for Young Dolph. This whole thing could turn into a Fed case. And Yo Gotti could end up getting jammed up in the whole thing. But they're going to need the evidence or they're going to need somebody to start talking and snitching. If everyone keep their mouth uh, closed, this whole thing, who knows how, how far this is going to go if, if, if everyone remains silent. But... It looks like now that the feds have been picking up others, I think this dude named Hernandez, and, and it looks like Big Juke's still free. So, anyways, like I said, the motive is not clear. So, if y'all know, let me know in the comment section, what is the motive be, behind the whole beef with Yo Gotti and Young Dolph? They both from the streets of Memphis. They both from the streets. So... It could have been some real shady stuff going on. Like I said, Young Dolph, who knows what he was up to when he was in the streets to get them so pissed off at him where they tried to take him out multiple times. The name keeps popping up every time Young Dolph was getting shot. I think he got shot like twice. Well, there was an attempt. At first, he had bulletproof windows. And then the next time, I believe he got shot in the arm or something. So there was multiple attempts. On Young Dolph before he got taken out. And the third time he got taken out. So why were they? Why couldn't they just let it go? Everyone was rich getting money. Why was Yo Gotti and them not willing to drop the beef? Was it behind? Was it really um, involving Big Juke possibly? Maybe, maybe this whole thing is involving Yo Gotti's brother. Who knows if it, if the beef is with Yo Gotti's brother Big Juke or if it's with Yo Gotti directly. But it seems like the beef comes down to the Gotti brothers. And for Yo Gotti to name himself that, I mean, a lot of times when people name themselves that, they, they really about their mob life. So Yo Gotti, I mean, it could have been about money. It could have been about something where Young Dolph might have did something dirty. Who knows? I mean, I don't think people just going to be out there trying to attempt on you that many times if it wasn't something serious. 
if it was just about money, I mean, they got money now. So I would guess it's probably this whole thing probably has more um, to do with something else, not just money. Because Yo Gotti got money, Young Dolph had money. So why would they be so worried about if Young Dolph did something shady that has to do with money? You know, to me, it almost seems like this whole situation is deeper than money. So we may never know why they hated Young Dolph so much that they needed him gone. He might have did something, you know, if, if it ain't had to do with money, it could have had something to do with a body or something possibly. And they want a revenge. Maybe something, you know, like I said, we I don't know. So let me know if y'all know. I'm just speculating on that it most likely had something to do with something very serious. More than money because they had money. So let me know what y'all think in the comment section. We're going to have to pay attention to this case and see what happens because it looks like it could turn Rico. Um, and if it turns Rico, Yo Gotti and CMG, I mean, they already got 42 Doug locked up. He was on the run, so they locked him up. Uh, so I don't know what I mean. CMG, they got Glorilla, like I said. And um, it looks like he just couldn't stay out, out of trouble. Yo Gotti, I mean, this is a lot of heat. But like I said, I mean, if they remain solid, if, if they don't talk, they might be able to get out of this one. We're going to just have to see. So, look, links are in the comment section if you want to check out Rap Hits.